Hello everybody and welcome to our next video tutorial on open card. And today in this video I'm gonna show you how to style uh, featured products on on your home page. And as you can see um, I I changed some colors, background and font colors and also I add some extra uh, rotation effect on the, to the image of each product. So today I'm gonna show you how to do this. Okay, let's start. As you can see uh, by default um, products, uh, feature products box that doesn't have um, background um, colors. So I'm gonna show you how to uh, add some background colors. So let's go ahead and open our CSS file that we've been working in previous videos and go ahead go to the line number 533 and over here we're gonna add a background property and we're gonna make it color snow so let's save refresh and now as you can see we have uh, this background color so next step, uh, we're gonna add background to description and a caption area, middle area. So let's go ahead to our CSS file again. Let's go to the line 558. So it's um, so and over here and uh, in this rule we're gonna add another background property and we're gonna um, make it color azure so let's save and refresh here we go now we have this um, background um, so um, another step uh, we're gonna change color of this uh, footer um, so let's go ahead go back to our CSS file and then go to the line number 631 um, 632 so and over here we're gonna change background color to gold and color of the font we're gonna change to brown so um, next um, we're also gonna change hover effect so we're gonna switch colors so now this is gonna be gold and uh, background color will be brown so let's save it go back refresh and as you can see now we have this uh, this gold background and with a br brown color and when you hover the colors they switch so um, next step we're gonna do it it's we're gonna eliminate this uh, space between the picture of the products and the description of the product so let's go ahead back to our CSS file let's go to the 560 line um, and over here we're gonna change this padding of the vertical padding we're gonna make it 10 pixels so let's save go back to our page and refresh as you can see now we eliminated this uh, gap between between description and image so um, uh, next step uh, I'm gonna show you how to change uh, color of this uh, link uh, of uh, product link so let's go ahead so um, we're gonna go to <coughs> Approximately this line, and we're gonna add, add some new uh, rule. So I already 
uh, copied this rule so pretty much saying that uh, uh, this link is gonna be uh, this crimson color so uh, another step we're gonna add um, rule for the same uh, the same link that when you hover so just need to add hover and we're gonna need dark green color so let's save and refresh try what we have so we here so when you hover you see it's changed so um, uh, last step I'm gonna show you how to add some uh, effect to this image so let's go ahead to our back to our style sheet so in here uh, we need to go to 540 uh, it's this rule as you can see we right now we have opacity and we're gonna add some two extra properties so pretty much it's rot uh, it's rotate uh, 360 degrees around and during one second and you can always uh, change uh, the timing or degree so let's save it and see so now as you can see um, we have this effect but we have slightly problem on the bottom as, as you can see we have scroll bar so we're gonna eliminate this so let's go back again to our CSS file and here we're gonna uh, change this property or the overflow we're gonna change to hidden hidden save it fresh and here we go now it's working and you don't have scroll bar on the on the bottom so here we go uh, here's our tutorial um, and thank you for watching and see you next time bye